have you ever wondered that how nature selects the path of the movement of a particle or if I put in this way is that out of the many infinite possible paths how does nature know which possible path to select or how does it select this particular possible path this is actually beautifully laid out in the principle of least action and Euler Lagrange equation is the mathematical heart we know that nature is very lazy but it is very smart so it doesn't waste any time so what is what it does is it always takes the path for which it is called the action and the action is defined as the total Lagrangian over the time and as you can see in the equation L is the Lagrangian T is the kinetic energy and V is the potential energy now if I may ask you this question does this tiny change increase or decrease the path so the condition of the real path is that it does not it is always stationary the condition is given by this a little bit complicated looking equation which is called the euler lagrange equation where q is the coordinate like the position and q dot is the rate of change of velocity so all in all what does this equation actually tells it tells that the way the system moves the, its equation of motion is the one that makes the action stationary if you plug in l equals to t minus v for a simple particle what you get is this one newton's second law f equals to a ma so the beauty is that instead of pushing forces around what the nature uh, how it moves etc nature just chooses the most efficient story to tell the story is written in Euler Lagrange equation now this Euler Lagrange equation is actually kind of an extension of Newton's uh, kinematics or Newton's laws of motion in a more generic fashion it has got a huge amount of implication not only in physics but in economics and various other ways which in which Lagrangian can be uh, used very interesting story about how Euler pushed Lagrange to make this equation and publish Eul Lagrange's equation uh, first before Euler published it and this is what is called in the calculus of variations if you go to my channel physics for students you will find there is a short video which is called the story of Euler and Lagrange please look into that you will find a beautiful fascinating history unfolding before you and you know what is Euler Lagrange equation